Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in. What we have here today is a Toshiba Satellite C855D laptop that has a busted screen. If you see, there you go. Yeah, so you can see that the screen is all broken and what we're going to do is go ahead and replace it. So, so the first thing we're going to want to do is remove the battery. Now you always want to remove battery from electronics whenever you're working on them because you don't want to short anything out or burn anything up. That would be bad and then you'd have to replace it. Okay. All right. Now the next thing is there is going to be little stickers in the four corners here that have screws behind them. We're going to have to take those stickers off and then take the screws out. So let's go ahead and start that. I like to use like a little razor or exacto knife to get in there and remove the sticker. Now you just want to take out those four screws. Okay, and now we want to just get a pry tool and put it right in the seam and just kind of work it along the seam of this laptop to pop the screen bezel off. that you just want to gently wiggle and lift there we go front bezel is now off okay so now with that done I do want to 
gently pull the screen forward and we should be able to get our screwdriver in there to get you can see the screws that are on the side you should be able to get our screwdriver in there and get these off And you just want to repeat it for the other side. You don't want to apply too much force because then you might pop the hinge out from the back here and that would be bad but there's a little bit of wiggle room so if you're gentle you can get away with not having to take the hinges out and take the screen out that way Now we should be able to just pull towards us and the screen will come out and you just want to gently pull up on this LCD cable because it's going to be taped down and then you also want to gently lift up on the tape holding that in and then just pull it out. Now we have the replacement screen. So I'm just gonna drop that down and gently put this connector in you want to be gentle because it's very delicate and you don't want to mess this up You just want to push down, make sure that tape is on there nice and good. So it's not going anywhere. Sometimes it's good to add more tape, but this is on there pretty good. I don't think we need to do that for this one. All right. Now you prop it back up and line it up and install the screws again. So I'm just going to go ahead and install everything though. Same way we took it apart, and uh, then we'll test it. Before we put this thing 100% uh, back together, I just want to plug it in and make sure the screen works. there you go you see that we have a uh, working screen now so I'm just gonna let this boot up properly and then shut it down and then uh, put it all back together
So now we have it fully together and uh, the little stickers are still missing, but I'm going to put those on when I'm not wearing these gloves because it's a real pain to do that with these gloves on. But we're just going to make sure that it turns on again. And there you go. So it's a simple screen to replace. These Toshibas are relatively easy to work on, but uh, that's our video. Hope you guys liked it. Um, be sure to like and subscribe. Um, and stay tuned for the next one. Thanks for watching.